Hi guys and welcome back to the Cassie Projects. So this week's video we're going to be doing an episode of 365 days of art and I have completed a week and yeah I've been doing it all week and I've had some fun. I've used lots of different supplies and just yeah been a bit creative and I've really enjoyed it. Today's prompt is draw a collection of vegetables. So a little bit different but I think I'm going to really enjoy it. So who is a fan of vegetables I am I actually love vegetables I hated them as a kid so comment of the day do you like vegetables or not because um, I imagine that probably not a lot of people do um, but I do now I th I th they're my favorite thing in the the meal because well I'm a vegetarian now so I don't eat meat um so vegetables have to be the, the best bit of the meal um but yeah it's made me a lot better at cooking because i really make a bit of effort with the vegetables now um but anyway that's me nattering on about vegetables a little bit weird i really enjoy this prompt because i really enjoy drawing food actually and i get to do my line and wash watercolor which you know i, I really enjoy and yeah so it's not out of my comfort zone today whereas the prompt before the seventh oh that was way out of my comfort zone it was draw someone from memory and I, I have a hard enough time drawing faces as it is never alone not being able to look at a picture so this is my little daughter <laughs> as you can see there this is Layla um it's it's not very good but I, you know I had to try and it pushes you this book pushes you it really does so now we're going in with the watercolour. Um, I wanted to kind of do a little bit of a step by step with the carrot. So I'm using a nice fat brush and I'm going in with this orange colour. And I'm just going where the darker parts would be and leaving that shadow white. Um, and then I'm using a wet brush just to smudge that in a little bit. So we've got a bit of a, a highlight there and it looks a little bit more natural. So then I'm going in with a little bit of a darker orange, just going in those grooves and just making it a little bit more 3D by bringing in the darker values around the edge of the carrot. Um, so again, I'm doing this very wet on wet because it just gives it a bit more of a natural look. I wanted it to all look a little bit sketched, a little bit messy. You, you'll see with my um, fine lining, I didn't do these precise lines. I wanted it to look like it had been sketched in pen. I wish I could go straight in with pen. That would be so much more fun. Um, but I'm too scared. I have to go in with pencil first. So now back to the carrot. Now it's a little bit more dry. I'm going in with the green leaves. And then I'm using more of a, a brownie kind of orange. And I'm really bringing in the dark values underneath to, again, make it look more 3D. I'm going in quite messily. And because, you know, vegetables aren't perfect. That, that's the beauty of them. And yeah, just adding in lots of dark brown in the creases. And I'm really, really pleased with how that came out. So now I'm going in with all the different parts, the mushroom, again, going in with the darker bits first, and then I'll add the lighter bit afterwards. I had a fair few comments on my last video saying that they wanted to join in this 365 days of art challenge. Um, there's a, a fair few people that have got this book. Um, so if you have got it, crack it out and join me because that will push me to do it. I'm going to find it quite difficult to do this on my own because, you know, a year is a long time. So if you can all join me and keep me going, that'd be really good. So with the aubergine uh, or eggplant, if you're American, um, um, it, it, this was really fun because the, the, the purple was so perfect for an aubergine colour. It, it's just, a, a, yeah, perfect purple. So, but then I added a little bit of black to it for the, for the bottom part, which gave it this really dark, yummy purple. I really like that purple. I think it's just beautiful. But I left the little white bit in the middle so that we've got that highlight. But, you know, I'll play with that a bit more later. The cauliflower, I think, was the hardest one. I tried to draw that. It just looked like a little alien to start with. But now I've got the colour on there. I'm quite pleased with it. Um, my least favourite, I think, is my pumpkin. I'm not happy with that. how that came out because it was just a bit muddy. Um, I think I ruined it with the stem. But never mind. We can fix it up a little bit. Going in with my bleed proof white just to add those little details. But I am going to go over them again with a bit of colour so it's not so harsh because obviously... 
vegetables don't have dark lines on them so as you can see I'm just blending that out just to make it look a little bit more realistic and um, there you go there are my beautiful vegetables I'm so pleased with them I think they've turned out great and I think this would be a really nice print for a tea towel or like an oven glove that sort of thing I really liked the the whole composition of it I think it's uh, turned out really nice and all the colors work together so yeah that is my day eight of um 365 days of art um yeah let's hope that I can keep going for another week <laughs> I'll see you Friday bye if you haven't already feel free to subscribe to my channel I really appreciate the support or head over to the Cassie Projects on Facebook Instagram or TikTok you can also head over to my website at thecassieprojects.co.uk to find stickers, art prints and even a free gift. Feel free to binge some more videos by clicking the buttons or I'll see you next week. Bye!